Welcome, my geekers and my geekettes. Here, we are going to be reacting to the Comic-Con trailers that's been going on for the past couple of days. This trailer reaction that we're going to be doing now, it's Shazam! Fury of the Gods. Let's get it. Get it. I'm an idiot. Oh, yeah. It's showtime! I don't deserve these powers, if I'm being honest. Like, what am I even contributing? Yikes. Ow! There's already a superhero with a red suit with a lightning bolt on it. Aquaman is literally uh, huge. Uh, uh, so well, let's talk about him better. Batman is so cool. And I don't... Just me? Uh, yeah. Oh! 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 I feel like a fraud. It doesn't matter. Um, anyway, a wizard gave me superpowers. I mean, everybody got superpowers. I love that. I love They're all that. gone. Aww. Did you cry? Okay. <laughs> now everyone's kind of like doing their own thing, and I'm the only one trying to keep it together. You understand I'm a pediatrician. Oh, uh, <laughs> Come on, that's Annabelle. The dog. Oh, I, I missed it. The fate of the world depends on it. The daughters of Atlas are coming for you. Oh, Mary and Mr. Louis. Children stole the power of all the gods. This is very personal. Oh. <laughs> I might not have as much experience as you because I'm not super old like you. I've Ooh. seen all of the Fast and the Furious movies, lady. It's all about family. Dude, the fuck? Family! <laughs> Guys, that was a signal. I thought he was going to go take out the shoes in Fast and Furious. The Goonies. Interesting. This looks fun, y'all. Uh, this looks fun as hell. Christmas. This looks fun as hell. I'm, I'm gonna fun say something that's probably going to be talked about in the comments. I'm okay. Mm. I like this trailer better than Black Adam. I thought it was more fun. fundamentally sound. No, not just fun, because I I'm not gonna I'm not gonna compare apples to oranges like that because mm. I feel like their tones are too separate. So I don't think that that's fair. Mm -hmm. I think that like. For me, going into looking at this trailer, I have a good idea about what is going on, what is expected to see. Going into the Black Adam trailer, either one that this that just came out or the one that came out before, all you really see is footage of, of Dwayne Johnson as Black Adam. You don't really see the conflict that's happening. You see the introduction of different characters, okay? But you don't see a conflict. You consistently will see a conflict of what is happening and what is basically gonna go on. I like that personally. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um I I, I I like Shazam. I think that Levy is just he's awesome mm -hmm. as Shazam Shazam. Mm -hmm. I think that he does a great job and he's gonna continue to do a great job. Mm -hmm. The more that they focus on the superhero family and even less of the regular characters to me is the better. Mm. Um, even though I did like that little like hug scene that was pretty cute. Um, but yeah, I, I mean, listen, it's Christmas, so you know we're gonna see it. Let's go. Well, well to me, I think, uh, you know, because we have, we have had like about three trailers of Black Adam and Black Adam was a more of a revenge. He, he's more of personified as a, like an anti-hero type dude. Um, so mm -hmm. you know he 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 brought a more darker side to the um, from you know between Shazam and Superman and whatever. I think they're trying to hide a lot of details to what this um, thing is going to be entailed and into, and, and 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 I guess that's why you're kind of iffy about it because you want to see exactly what this movie is going to be about. Something. However, however. Um, 
you know, I, there's not a lot of people who don't want to, well, some people want to see uh, less. That when they go into the movie, they see something that, you know, is surprising, basically. Mm-hmm. So, um, I am expecting really good things from um, Black Panther. Um, Black Adam, sorry, mm-hmm. and um, mm-hmm. of course Zab, Shazam. You know we're gonna be looking for the quirky comedy type thing. I hope mm-hmm. it doesn't go overboard um, with True. the comedy. True. I hope there is a good a, balance. A, yeah. a, you know, ba- balance level where we can appreciate it for being what it is. You know, it's funny because people will also <laughs> lambasted in a sense the original Shazam. I was like, it's really funny in this part, and then it's really dark in this part. Mm. That tone for me, that shifting a tone for me wasn't actually that bad. Mm. I don't want it to be like you said, over, over the top. Like, mm. why are they making this joke for the seventh yeah, time exactly. and they're talking about it in two or three yeah, minutes? We don't need that for that. We like really that, that. Yes, we like. Yeah, I, I agree with that. Mm-hmm. But um, I don't, like I said, for me, honestly, that first Shazam, mm-hmm. I was okay with the mixed tones. I really was. I thought I'm, it played I'm, well. I'm not sure if you noticed, but the kids that are in this, they, they old as hell. Yeah, they, they old as hell. Yeah. I so, definitely saw know, I, I think they need to switch it up a gear a little bit to keep the quirkiness mm-hmm. a little bit on the low, but a little bit more in a serious direction, um, you know, to other continuations of that. Yeah. If you like what you see and what you heard, let, let us hear from your comments. Mm-hmm. Um, you know, check us out on Instagram at Geek by Heart. Twitter and TikTok Please at Geek like, by Heart share, too. as usual. Check us out on the next video what we're gonna be dealing with. What we're gonna deal with? I think we're gonna be doing um, uh, Rings of Power. Rings of Power. Rings of Power. So stick around, guys.